Lisa Daniels, and uh, she's got some great ideas about community wind that she wants to share with you, and it's pretty exciting. So I'd like to her to just tell you a little bit more. Okay, so I am the executive director of Windustry. Windustry is a nonprofit based in Minneapolis, but we work throughout the U.S. working on community wind energy. Community wind energy is where there's local ownership of wind energy projects. They can be large wind energy projects, small wind energy projects, but they are locally owned. Keeps these keeps those energy dollars local, more green jobs, more um, bank loans on a local basis to uh, local entities. Um, it also helps to grow uh, the supply chain in in the rural areas to uh, to put these wind projects together. Uh, the supply chain includes things like the concrete that goes into building uh, the foundation for the large commercial scale wind turbines. Also, uh, the steel tubular towers. Um, need to be produced here in the U.S. because they are too large and too heavy to import overseas. Also the blades, the wind energy blades, totally something that needs to be built here in the U.S. And do you produce that in Minnesota? Do we produce what? All the supply chain or is that distributed? Throughout? Uh, yeah, we're working on putting all of the supply chain pieces and parts together in Minnesota and in the Midwest and uh, trying to get those green jobs in the ground. Um, actually, and distributed generation of wind energy, um, putting wind projects in on the local distribution grid helps get more wind energy in place quicker. Um, so you don't have to, you don't have to always build a hundred megawatts at a time. Sometimes you can do five megawatts, 10 megawatts, 20, 40 megawatts, and that can be on the, either the, you know, the existing distribution grid or the slightly upgraded distribution grid. Shovel ready, that's what Obama wants. Right. Shovel ready wind energy, yeah. Well, this uh, lady is pretty passionate about wind energy, you can tell, and uh, pleasure to talk with you tonight. And I uh, hope you have a great night. Thank you. All right, thank you.